Really? Really? Moving like the speed of sound. What is going on guys? This is Bullet Training Z and welcome back to the channel with a new update for Gran Turismo Sport. Update details 1.41. Here on the channel we have the Jaguar D-Type 54, the Mazda Roadster, Touring Car, the Honda S800, 66, Honda Civic Type R, EK, everyone's favorite, known on the game, and it's an HD, and it's a premium. And we also have the Porsche 911 Turbo 930 81. And we have a few new events and the bug fixes and physics model uh, the car's behavior after running over. Uh, oh, okay, well, that's that's also new, but they fixed, which is good. Lobby fixes for bugs and stuff like that. The arcade. And this, well, here it is. Um, if you guys have the game you can you know read the list here what the updates are and stuff like that but what we are going to do is play single player I guess and continue on from there um, I'm not gonna be doing much for this update just you know I guess drive these two cars on stock play on medium because I don't feel like playing on higher difficulty and yeah Gran Turismo Sport here for the PlayStation 4 this is the newest update out today and it's just been released I'm up I'm recording this right now at uh, it's now 819 so this video will be out a little bit later That actually, that actually doesn't sound too bad. So, now we are here, and like I said, we're gonna drop the stock, but with no traction control and stuff, and default settings for gears. Okay, we're gonna see what this Porsche can do. This thing looks fuck. This thing, this car looks awesome. I'm glad. I'm actually really glad that they put this on here, and they still haven't fixed the camera on this game. Of course, Penifini, you never fix your cameras, do you? Porsche Turbo. It's stock, so we're gonna see what this thing can do stock. And this is a, one of my other favorite cars I wanted to drive for the longest time since the Need for Speed era. And this car looks really clean. Jeez. It drives really good, too. Like I said, we're going to drive it stock, but I mean, for a stock car, this car drives really fast. But when it comes to turns, it's it's not really the best for me anyway. We're about to pass the Ferrari. Damn. Brakes was locking a little bit. I'm gonna pass the Raptor. Slowly passing everybody at a lower pace, I guess. I don't know. Mustang. The Apex. BMW Z8. Which I used to be a fan of, but not anymore. Sorry. Damn, G-Rod is really nice. And I'm driving manual transmission. That looks like an RUF, but it's a Porsche. It really does, from like the back. It looks like an RUF because of the color too. But you know, that download's already done. And this game's gonna take up more space as we go along. We got the Ferrari F50. Making in third was in third place and this car keeps winning the slide so I mean it is what it is this is my first time actually driving this car in stock and not tuned and I'm having fun with it I'm using a controller not a wheel
Really? Really? That actually just happened too. This car is very tail happy. And does it does not handle very bad what amount of horsepower it, it holds at all. Got too cocky. Got way too cocky. I just wanted to see what it could do. See what like kind of abuse this car can handle. Don't get me wrong, this car can handle it. This car really can. That turbo, man. When that turbo kicks in, it's over. It's a done deal. This little beetle right here. With only four gears. Look at that. Cuts corners so well. Well, it doesn't cut corners, but it turns so well around that corner. Well, no problem. I love it. I absolutely love this car. This is probably one of my one of my favorite updates right now. The other one was a disappointment, but this one's actually not too bad. All right, so we're gonna do one more track for this event. Uh, might do Willow Springs. No, we're gonna drive here. Um, just gonna drive here. Fuck it. Uh, daytime. We're gonna drive the Honda, which everyone's, uh, you know. The EK Type R 90, 98? Yeah, okay. I'm so bad at naming cars, but I mean, I used to be a car person. You should know this stuff. Well, I actually really kind of don't. I still have to learn about these things. So, yeah, we're driving this Honda EK 98 VTEC. That sounds good, but too bad they can't put the actual sound in here. We're gonna drop the stock on the highway. We're gonna see what this EKV Tech Type R can do, boys. Jesus. It's definitely a manual. It looks really nice in the inside interior, though. You can see that VTEC just kicking in. That VTEC is just kicking in so quickly. Got American cars on the highway. Supra. Try to pass the Supra. VTEC not kicking in yet. Now it's kicking in. There's the VTEC. Look at it. I this Honda. I love this Honda though. This Type R. Ninety eight. It's a really good car. I know everybody's been waiting for this car for the longest time to be on here. And I'm sure everyone has a drag tune for it. A racing tune for it. A lot of liveries have been released already. That people already made. VTEC, bitch. Once that VTEC kicks in, man, it's just, it's overall sweet. So we got the, and I hit the wall. So we got the Nissan 250Z. Hit the wall again, I don't care. We got the NSX on there. And then we have the Mazda in front. And that VTEC is kicking in again, yo. Look, that's my baby right there. But that's not the 2002. 
So. That VTech keeps kicking in. Can you go any slower, bro? This is why I don't like facing AI. Yep. Farther along on this update, there are no new tracks. That's also a dis that's really a disappointment to me personally. And really just no no new track. They have no new tracks on here yet. Just cars. I mean you you get what you can get. I, I love getting the updates every month, don't get me wrong, but a new track would have would have been nice. Nice addition to the game. Like special stage route five. Or eleven. You know, make a return, but that's not gonna happen. Maybe in Grand Turismo 7. In HD. 4K or 8K, yeah, but not on here. It's really sad. So we gotta kind of deal with the whole non HD graphic enhancement. I, I broke the headlight. Um. Classic tracks, which you know, Pernifity Edition would not provide for GT Sport because it's disappointing, and we just gotta deal with it. I'm playing it simple. I'm on the third lap already, and it feels like I'm taking forever though in this video just to make it. But it's pretty much simple and straightforward. I still can't drive this car worth shit, but then again, we're driving it stock, and that's the whole point of this video: driving them stock. You guys, gonna say, "Ow, damn it, that kind of hurt." I don't know what the hell that was, but it was in my leg. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys are enjoying this video. I hope you guys enjoy your week. Uh, I've been streaming for a few days now. It's been really hot, been really crazy. It's been really busy. At some point, and we got good internet, so um, yeah, I'm proud of that. I can actually upload my videos at home instead of going out and take the time out of my day and it's way too hot and just waiting so now I can actually really upload my videos with no problem and probably about next year I'm gonna be moving which I can't wait to move so that's another step moving forward, and a lot of stuff is going on, so I will keep you guys up to date on that. A lot of work needs to be done, so, I mean, it is what it is. I ain't mad. VTech, yo. Oops. I am fucking terrible. 13 minutes into the video. And I'm not doing bad though. I keep crashing to the wall. This is the only car I've crashed all day. We did it! Yay! We did it. We actually crossed the line in five minutes. Got some credits. Almost not even 20 miles. Which it's in 200. Not bad. Still fast though. But anyway, this is Bullet Train HD, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And this is new update 1.41. And I also have the Miata uh, Mazda Roadster touring car, which I don't really care too much about. But it's mainly these two I wanted to do for this video. And if you guys want to see my liveries, they are all on my page on here. So feel free to follow me. And I don't know, that's it. That's all I got to say for this video. All my links are down below. Subscribe if you're not new. Grand Turismo's update, the Civic is finally here, guys, for free, microtransactions are just bullshit, but we're moving like the speed of sound, I'll see you guys in the next video.